Hello Fredbach friends, it's Julia, the Fredbach intern, and I'm very excited to introduce you to a brand new video series that we're putting out where I review choir music folders. Now, choir music folders are something that a lot of people don't think about, but they are a necessity to choir directors and choir performers. I'm a choir performer, I've gone through a lot of different folders and folder types, and I'm comfortable with a certain kind, and I, I know what works and what doesn't. So I'm by no means incredibly experienced, but I know what the people want. My requirements for a folder is that I think it should be sturdy, so that it doesn't feel all floppy or wonky during choir music performances. Uh, I think it should be able to hold multiple sizes of music because in a lot of choir performances you've got different sizes, you've got octavos, you have requiems, you know, things that come in all different shapes and sizes. So can the folder fit everything that you need for that concert? I think it should be able to hold the music securely so that it doesn't slide back and forth during a performance. That's very stressful. I know I've always been afraid of dropping all my music during the middle of a concert. I can't even imagine how embarrassing that would be. Luckily, it hasn't happened yet. And is there a difference between hole punch folders and not hole punch folders like the strings or the ring binders? And can it work both ways? Or what is it like to have music that is not hole punched in a binder? And we'll be exploring that a little bit in these videos. And finally, a bonus point is, is there a spot in the folder to hold a pencil? Because we all know how important it is to mark the music with a pencil when your choir director says to mark the score. So we'll be looking at all of those requirements that I have come up with just out of the top of my head, and we'll be seeing how these products work with them. So before I started this project, I contacted some of our editors on the Fredbach board and asked them what their favorite type of choir music folder is to use. A lot of them are choir directors as well. And the overwhelming response that I got was musicfolder.com. They said, that's the one that we use, we really like it. So I reached out to several different companies, musicfolder.com being one of them. Unfortunately, I did not hear back from musicfolder.com, so I don't have any products to review from them today. I reached out to Music Folder, My Music Folder, Poplar's Music, CBP Black Folder, Deer River Folio, and marloplastics.com. And out of everyone that I contacted, I heard back from mymusicfolder.com, cbpblackfolder.com, and marloplastics.com. So they all sent me samples, and I'm really excited to open them up with you guys. I haven't looked at them yet, so I kind of feel like a choir nerd on Christmas morning. It's gonna be a lot of fun. I'll tell you what each folder has to offer. I'll try some different pieces of music in them of different sizes to see how everything fits. Um, and yeah, I'll let you know what I think of the products. I'm really excited and I can't wait for you guys to see what we have in store for you guys. So stay tuned for those videos. Make sure to subscribe to our channel and give this video a thumbs up, share it with your friends. We've got some great content coming for you. So stay tuned. Thank you.